awesome. Next up we have elliptical orbits. So this shape is called an ellipse and it is elliptical because it is not perfectly circular. And the more elliptical it is, the more eccentric it is. The eccentricity is a measure of how elliptical or how not circular the orbit is. So, so there's some key things to know that at each ellipse, there are two centers and they're each called a focus. Each of them, um, or together they're called foci or foci. At one of them, there's empty space. There's like nothing there. It exists, but like there's not a physical object there. And at the other one, we have the sun. So all our planets are going around. Sometimes they're near the sun and sometimes they kind of slingshot away. Some things for you to know. This line right here is called the major axis. There's also a minor axis here, but we don't really care about that. It's just um, in a circle, the diameter is the same all the way around. And the major axis is kind of like the biggest diameter for this shape. And we also um, are ready to talk about the equation. So the equation for eccentricity is the distance between the foci, which is this distance, divided by the length of the major axis. And this is often written as the lowercase e equals lowercase d over l where D is in purple up there, and this is the length there, the length of the major axis. If you grab a ruler and you have this actually printed out, you can measure it out. The distance is about 5.8 centimeters, and the length of the shape, which should always be the bigger number, is 17.0 centimeters. And when you put that in your calculator, you get E, equals 0 0.341. There's no units because the centimeters cancel out. And you always want to round it to three decimal places. This is a pretty elliptical shape. Eccentricity ranges from 0 at a circle to 1, which is a line. So let's zoom in down here, get some empty space. If I start with a pretty perfect circle and then I can get more eccentric, it starts to get a little squished, a little more squished, a little more squished, and even more squished. That's increasing eccentricity, more eccentric. Awesome.